Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on The Witcher 3. Let's go ahead and examine some stuff here. Edges curled out. Something inside blew it wide open. Wall 2. Hmm. Bathhouse drain pipes seem to converge here. Ugh. And I thought Witcher's potions were vile. Shut up, Geralt. Take it. Drink the potion like a man. Pipes great. Explosion crumpled it like a piece of paper. And there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Blast tore it's it from the wall. Clear no over traces here. of magic. Must have been one no spell. Blast. It was a bomb. Now why am I not finding okay, pieces so of it? Could be here. the this current swept good. them away. I think... Where is the dude that he hired? Isn't he dead somewhere around here? Oh yeah, good stuff to Drowners. sell. Of course. Go ahead and loot this drowner. Okay. There we go. Come on, I know there's more of you drowners. Now, I guess there's not anything else to loot. Alright, let's keep on moving. Ah, here we go. I'm happy to be back not on Death March. As much fun as the game on the hardest difficulty was, it it, it gets to be a Oh shit! Oh shit! They got me in a oh my god, they got me stun locked! What the hell? Oh my god, they had me stun locked there. That was stupid as all hell, dude. Mm, bottom of a container. Silver cylinder, most likely. Runes etched in the bottom. It's warped, probably by the explosion. Bomb part. Must be. Gold coin. Smells like... Wyvern oil. And... Caramel. Alright, let's head on back. I want to keep my eyes out. That'd be it down here. Time to see Dijkstra. Okay, I want to keep my eyes out for, I think it's this. Hmm. Definitely came through here. Yeah, that's what I want to keep my eyes out Deekstra for. Dijkstra didn't mention anyone else. Must be one of Dandelion's crew. Vomit everywhere. Guess he had the antidote too. Couldn't keep it down any more than the other guy. Need to burn the corpses. Otherwise, Draenors will never stop congregating. Because there should be another ring down here. I think the other ring is worth the most. Um, let's see. I'm not saying it. I guess it's not... Wait, is that it? No. There it is, right there. Another trinket. Alright, so the pearl is worth the most. I thought it was two rings, but... Guess maybe there's another ring lying on the ground. I'm not gonna look. It's so small. It doesn't matter. It's ex it's insignificant in this playthrough. I have a ton of money already. Like I don't think it's hugely necessary that I find everything. <laughs> this is just a playthrough to see how to see what it's like to end up with Triss. So I think after I complete this playthrough, I'm gonna take a little bit of a break while I'm uploading Fallout New Vegas as long along with Dead Space. Uh, and then we'll come back at, to it after we finish up New Vegas. We'll start the Completionist playthrough. Uh, and I think the Completionist playthrough should take us between the Completionist, Fallout New Vegas, uh, Dead Space 1, 2, and 3. I think that should take us all the way up to uh, the new Gears release. At, uh, I might Got be. Got a minute? I do. What do you want? I'm done investigating. Done. Examined every nook of the sewers near your vault. Well? Learn anything? Seems to me a bomb blew the wall open. Look. Bottom of a silver cylinder, probably. Covered in runes. Interesting. Any idea what it contained? Recognized some ingredients by their scent. Wyvern oil and sugar. Sugar? Geralt, I'm in no mood for jests. 
Nor am I. Just saying what I found. Bomb contained sugar. Let's think. Sugar would react violently with sulfuric acid, but not so violently to cause an explosion. Didn't know you were versed in alchemy. Dabbled in it a bit, while at Oxenford Academy. But this is no time to reminisce. You're to find my treasure, not write my biography. Know anything else about this bomb? Anything at all? Bomb went off inside a drainage pipe embedded in the vault wall. But the grate at the end of the pipe was in place when the blast happened, meaning... The bomb must have found its way into the pipe from inside the bathhouse. Exactly. Might have gone something like this. Perpetrator started emptying one of the pools, then dropped the bomb down the drain. The bomb flowed down with a runoff, came to rest on the grate, and, to quote Bart, big boom. Drain pipes are only promising lead. We just need to know which pool it's connected to. Yes. Atom keeps a record of guests. Should be able to tell us who used that pool the day of the break-in. You've not done badly. Feel honored to be acknowledged. Oh, that famous sarcasm. I missed it. Really? Hmm, about as much as I'd miss a knife in me knickers. All right, you inspect the pools on the right, I'll take the ones on the left. Holler if you find anything. All right, so I believe it's... Actually, I believe it's not this one. <laughs> I went to the wrong side. It's this one back here. Silver lid. Matches the cylinder bottom I found in the sewer. Dijkstra, come here. Oh, hey, that's the first that you that's all you have to examine. A full lucky guess. Got something? Yeah. Bomb part. Happen. Drain pool four. And bring me the guest book. Chop chop. Let's see what's on the bottom. Grate's been removed from the drain, meaning they flushed the bomb down here. Happen, who used this pool the day of the break-in? Let me see. Uh, Bertolt Heinz, town councilman, Josef Schweik, brewer, and Margrave Henkel. Henkel? That's impossible. Margrave Henkel, who's that? Who was that, you mean? Old Coach been eating dirt since last winter. Couldn't have been here the day of the break-in. He's dead. I've not heard. Not surprising. The Honorable Margrave croaked in a brothel, decked out in leather lingerie, so the family held a hush-hush funeral. But I have my sources. Yeah. Yeah, I saw him that fateful day, Mr. Reuven. I'm certain of it. Did you speak to him? Get a good look at him? No. He merely passed by on the way in. So you didn't see Henkel. You saw an impersonator. Think for once. They scooped out your balls, not your brain. And you, Geralt, start looking into this. Fine. Where should I start? Henkel's home. Derelict townhouse south of the main square. You might happen on some trace of this scoundrel we're looking for there. Well, off with you. All right, so we need to go to Margrave Hankel's house, and then we'll get uh, then we'll get to meet up with Triss, and then we'll have to solve this whole Siggy Rubens treasure with Triss. All right, so let's head to Margrave Hankel's house. Let's go ahead and uh, have the game freeze on me. <laughs> Let's wait till the day. We're almost to the day anyway, but let's go ahead and get get back to the day. And let's get this pops mold off of off of my hot bar. Let's go back to Swallow. Is this sword better? It is better. Let's put that sword on. Are these boots better? Yes they are. They're better boots. Weapon repair, armor repair. There we go, then I don't have to head to someone to repair His that. Armies. All right, so this is like a, it's not really a speed run, it's like a semi-speed run. 
it's like a very lazy speedrun, I guess, because I'm listening to dialogue. I um, might actually try to speedrun this game on very, I don't know, that may be a playthrough, depending, I'm not entirely sure on when games come out, well I just ran right by our house, um, I'm not really sure exactly what the release dates for all the games I pre-ordered, but I think October and September are pretty dry, I don't think there are a ton of games that come out, so we may be still playing Witcher 3 into that area. Okay, I don't think I need to... Okay, we're just gonna head upstairs, I don't think I need to... ...loot anything. Let's go... Let's go up here, and then you wanna... Oh, you gotta pick up the note, hold on. Pick up the note, I think it's right here. A letter, and a bottle. The wine from your birth year. It's absolutely excellent. Startling bouquet. You absolutely must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. Your birth year. Could be dandelions. Or series. Okay. Oh, do I need to pick up the bottle? Okay, I gotta pick up the bottle. Are you just standing there like an idiot, Geralt? All right. Let's go ahead and loot that, and let's go ahead and put put it back in there. Twelve forty-five to twelve fifty-four. Hmm. <laughs> Satisfying click. In the next room over, I think. All right, so let's investigate the other room. Secret room. Probably where Dandelion and his cohorts planned the heist. Siri, Menge is following me. He has seized the treasure. He has Dandelion. You must flee. Footsteps. Not good. Okay, so we need to go ahead and check out what's downstairs. It's our first mention of doo doo in the game. And hey, look, it's Triss. And Triss. Have a word with Dijkstra. Didn't expect to see you here. Certainly not with Triss. I decided we could use someone who knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb, I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. Ah, Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelair wars, have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Bothered Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menge. Well, well, Marigold. Your coin stands to come with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. What I've learned doesn't matter. Doesn't matter? Yet you agreed to help me. I am. Doesn't mean I have to confess everything. I'll let your insolence fly this time. But only because his honor, the Margrave, might indeed have something to do with the theft. Hmm. Menga has been spending heaps of coin lately. Though to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menga spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit. Ask where he's holding my gold for me. Doubt Menga will admit anything willingly. As do I. Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. What's our past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive. With my treasure.
In other words, you're using us. Using you? Never. Merely making the most of your mutual bond. <laughs> well, lovebirds, I really must be going. Good luck. Thought you'd correct him. Say that we... You know. Could have corrected him yourself. True. But it's not an easy thing to say, is it? But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Triss, gotta tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Menga's got Dandelion locked up somewhere, and Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen, meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the Hunter's Barracks together. All right. See you then, and thanks. All right, so need to meet Triss, the Eternal Shrine near the harbor around midnight. So we'll go there. This is my buddy that converts my shit. Do I want? Do I need to sell? No, we're at 31 out of 130. So screw that. We don't need to sell. I'll wait until I get full and then sell. Really don't need to worry about it for now. Like I don't need to worry about money. <laughs> Really, I can probably beat the game with the weapons I have right now, but we'll just we'll just leave that as something. See, I would do a challenge run on Death March, but some of the stuff that you would do, I don't know, like use the starting equipment. That doesn't make for much of a. It just makes it so you would take two hours to kill a boss. Like that's all it would do. It just take you for freaking ridiculous, ridiculous amount of time to kill guys. That's all it would do. Which I guess makes, and you would probably get one shot by almost everything. That's what it would do, really. It's not really a challenge run, it's just an annoying run. <laughs> I guess it's a challenge run, but... Glad you're here. Listen, took a look at the building and it does not look good. Mean it could use a bit of paint and spackle? I mean, it's a damned fortress. High walls, guards at the gate, armed men everywhere. We could never sneak in, and fighting our way in won't work. Menga would have had plenty of time to escape. What do you suggest? Take these shackles. Put them on me. Uh, Triss, sure you want to do this? Out here, with everyone watching? This might come as a surprise to you, but shackles do have uses outside of the bedroom. Think. Bring the hunters the vile Triss Marigold. They won't just open the gate for you. They're likely to let you present her to Menga personally. No way. Too risky. Dandelion's life's on the line. Series 2. No such thing as too risky. Fine. Let's say they take the bait. What then? We go in, I put a sword to Menga's throat and ask him where Dandelion is? Might not work. Menga's scum, but you have to admit, death doesn't scare him. Always found that annoying in fanatics. So we gotta trick him into talking. Any ideas? Uh, maybe tell him you have information about the Lodge. Or about Philippa. Even better, he hates her most of all. You'll think of something. Wait. I want to thank you. Come on. Anyone would do this. No. Not anyone. Stop. It doesn't befit a sorceress to blush. Still got a bad feeling about this. But tough. Let's go. Geralt, remember, I can take care of myself. What are you talking about? The Hunters. They won't treat me like a lady, but I'll survive. Might hurt a bit, but... Siri, she's what matters. Do what you need to do, no matter what happens. Can't promise that. I'm still asking you to, all right? Hmm, all right.
So I've seen what uh, kind of the what plays out if you let them take her. But I'm going to kind of do, I'm going to see how far I can take her. I'm kind of interested. I want to see how far I can still have her with me without them taking her. I'm using this as an experiment to figure something out. What do you want? Here for my reward. On the Alpha. For a witch. Recognize who I got? It's Triss Marigold. Marigold? Come in then. Well, well. Triss Marigold. Giving up drowners for sorceresses. Pays better. It's cause they do more harm. What's a drowner do? Pull the odd fisherman from his boat. But the witches? They murder kings. Scheme. Start wars. Don't forget turning your cow's milk sour straight out of the udder. You're done jesting, Marigold. For good. Put her in a cell. Not so fast. I hand her over to Menga himself, or not at all. You reckon we don't know what to do with this witch? Let go, you bastard! Vulgar tongue's got no place being in such a pretty mouth. I guess we'll have to rip it out. Try to loosen it if I were you. Might learn something interesting. For instance? For instance, where Philippa Eilhart's hiding. I'll get you for this, you... Shut your gob, ginger whore! And you spit it out! Where's Eilhart? Thought I made myself clear. I'll only talk to Menga. Menga don't talk to the likes of you. Well, then you be sure to tell him I came by. With my friend Marigold. Fine. Grab her and come with me. But be sure to stay right close. Okay, so... She's still here. Alright, now this at the top of the stairs I think is as far, but I'm not sure. Son of a Beware. bitch. That's not what I wanted. For you know neither the day I walk nor so the slow? hour. These guys are super easy, like... Uh, Beware, which freak. Okay. Here's where we split up. Go see Menga. Marigold will be next door. You can't have her until I get... You don't set the terms here. Dirk, you know what to do. You won't get a word out of me. Not you, not him. Oh, play it tough, eh? Just you wait. We'll take a fingernail or three. That ought to get you singing. Fine, take her. I'd rather she didn't interrupt my conversation. But hands off, don't touch her. Why? Feel sorry for the bitch. No, couldn't give a shit about her. But if I don't get what I want from Menga, I'll want to sell her to someone else. Don't want you damaging the goods. Keen nose for enterprise. You'd make a great madam. Don't you worry. Menga will give you your coin, and Merigold will get what she deserves. No torture till I get there. Got it? Got it. No torture. What? The Horson's casting spells. Get him! Damn it! That doesn't work. The eternal fire will turn you to ash. Spread out! Well, well, that's as far as you can go with that. Wow, that dude takes like no damage. What the hell? Actually, I think he just has a shit ton of health. You little shit. Stop it. Stop it. I'm trying to kill your friend in the corner. Wow, this dude does a lot of damage, too. And he's a little shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Fall, fall. I'll, I'll work with the fall. I want him alive. Mistake. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. Come here, bitch. No. You little shits. Oh, I just shot that the wrong way. You little shits. That train sounds like it's right outside my house. It's two inches away. Where is that train? The train sounds so close. Sorry, bitch. Come here, you little shit. I don't lock on very often. I want to lock on to this guy. Is that really what locking on does? Oh god, I can't get up the stairs. Come on. Come on. Come on, girl. Why do I feel like I'm doing no damage? Okay. Come here. Come here, buddy. Wow, level 10, just like that. Hey, Menge. Hey, buddy. Wow, Menge, you are a joke. You're a joke, buddy. A freaking joke. You are pathetic. That's a joke. They call you... Oh, she is throwing fire at the witch hunters outside. Here, let me join in. The fun. I can throw fire too. Oh! That dude. The eternal oh, fire will turn you to ash. Oh, shit! Say goodnight, bitch. I thought that I thought that was gonna be one of those scenarios where that thing came in handy, the whatever it's called. The uh, Axie, having my Axie up. I thought that was gonna be a time where that came in handy, but no. A lot of the times you can influence their mind, but then someone just is like, oh, he's using shit to influence their mind, oh uh, and you just get screwed. Alright. Guess we'll go ahead and loot. I think that's all of them. That was close. Axie in a crowd? Geralt, there was no way that could work. Sorry. I couldn't let them torture you. You mean too much to me. We should search the office. Maybe we can find some documents mentioning Dandelion. I'll search his body. You search the room. I'd start with the desk. See, all of this would not be possible if Menge wasn't an idiot. If Menge didn't save that stupid letter from this guy, it would not e this would be a non-issue for him. But because he's an idiot and saved the letter, it becomes an issue. I clicked on quest, not inventory. Go over to quest items. Ah, uh, where is it? Letter to Kayla Menge. Caleb, I have new instructions regarding the organization of the next execution. When you are ready to meet, place your holy tome in the drop box located in the column with the Eternal Flame altar in the southwest corner of the bits. We will meet at the usual spots. Do not tell anyone where you are going or bring no one with you. Burn this letter after reading. See, if you just burn the letter after reading, this would be an, this wouldn't be an issue. This would not even be an issue. Find anything? Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Nothing under his belt. Wait. Something sewn in the lining. What is it? The key to a vault. Here. Give it to Dijkstra, with my regards. I'm not sure if you can actually find the vault. Like, I don't know if that's actually something you can do. I've seen several people do, the play, do their playthroughs, and they came to this scenario. You come to the scenario almost the same way. 
Like, you end up... Like, if you let them torture her, she just gets pissed and she kills them all. If you do it this route, or if you just say no at the beginning, you kill them all, you come to this. I don't know if there is a way to actually get the treasure. Unless in one of the dialogue options when you when they're torturing her, there is an option to either ask about Dandelion or ask about the treasure. And I'm not sure if you can ask about the treasure. I don't know exactly what it is, but I know that it's kind of a dicey situation. I found a letter to Menga from someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? Take a look. Drop boxes, secret signals. Yeah, strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Bet he does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so sure. Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this'll make Dijkstra smile? Well, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. All right. Nothing left for us here. Let's go. Be glad to. Just not by way of the main gate. All right, so let's go ahead and get on out of here. Okay. This is where we split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get out of here. Okay, so I think I'll wa we'll wa we'll watch her set this place on fire. And I don't think I ever watched her actually set the whole place on fire. We'll get a nice view. Watch her set this stuff on fire. I don't even see oh, there she is. I wish you could help. I wish you could join in. That'd be kind of fun, but you can't. It's sad because I watched somebody else try to uh, to join along and light stuff on fire, but. But uh, it's it's it did it, that it's just not happening, sadly. So it looks like the heat signed Amari Stoudemire. So that's pretty, that's pretty sweet. All right, so we watched her set that on fire enough. Let's get out of here. Okay, so let's go ahead, blast this bad boy open. Igni, gotta go talk to Dijkstra. You there! Mr. Roven wants a word! Impatient old bastard. What? Nothing. Be there soon. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will. Soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. Didn't see it anywhere, and 20 tons of gold is hard to miss. You mean to say you've come to me empty-handed? First off, you came to me. Second, I do have something in my hand. The key to a vault, founded on Menga. A vault that I need to find on my own. You've not made things much easier for me. Give me that. That's all you're gonna say? No wry remark, no scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? You lied to me. 
What? You knew from the start who robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. No, I didn't. But I did deign to help you find your treasure, so stop moaning. I jest you not, Geralt. You abused my trust. I can live with that. This time, yes, you'll live. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion? None. Found someone who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlack. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Thanks for your help. No need to thank me. Just paying off a debt. I always do, you know. Even to liars. And a final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. Alrighty guys, so we need to find the drop box using our Witcher Sense. Place the Holy Tome there to signal you want to meet with the spot. Uh, so that's going to do it for this episode though guys. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace out guys.